Tuscaloosa County school system is very thankful and excited for their continued partnership with Tuscaloosa One Place and Tuscaloosa County Commission for providing the funding for the additional five social workers. A social worker helps to be a support network in the school system. TCSS has added five new school social workers to make them a team of 14. Ten of the social workers hold master degrees in social work, while four of them hold bachelor degrees. Each social worker covers two schools, which will increase the number of TCSS schools served by a social worker. Suzette Wyatt says the ultimate goal is to get enough social workers to touch every school with Tuscaloosa County school system. So every school would be touched and that right now is our goal. If we could reach that we would feel like we have really accomplished something and that we could really begin to see some changes in our system. The needs for each school within the Tuscaloosa County school system are the same but some may differ in certain aspects. Dr. Eric Mackey, the state superintendent, has talked about social and emotional wellness and needs, which is why the position for mental health services coordinator for Tuscaloosa County Schools was created. Well, obviously mental health, mental wellness is nothing new, but I do think that um, in the academic world and the education world, it's starting to be, it's starting to become more realized that um, mental wellness is so important for academic success. The position helps bring awareness to mental health as well as strengthens the services provided for students and families. Kelly says that when a child is suffering from trauma or going through a tough family situation, it makes the child's ability to succeed academically very difficult. On top of that, COVID-19 has played a major role for some students and families anxiety and sadness. The Tuscaloosa County school system is encouraging the community to take this week to show appreciation to the school social workers. Reporting in Tuscaloosa, I'm Ajane Robinson, WVUA 23 News.